Hi friends and welcome back to Flow With D. Today's class is a lower body lazy leg day stretch. All you'll need is yourself and your mat. So once you're ready, let's begin. We'll begin today laying on your back, knees bent, feet pressed into the mat. As you gently close off your eyes, placing one hand on your heart and the other on your belly. Noticing how your belly gently rises and falls with each breath that you take. Allow this movement to gently guide you to this present moment and to settle you in to this class today as you take three deep inhales and slow exhales beautiful and on your next inhale interlace your hands around your right knee and drive it in towards your chest feeling that squeeze as you inhale here and as you exhale gently open your right knee out towards the right side feeling that inner thigh stretch. You're welcome to stay here with a bent knee or if you'd like, you can even extend your right leg long. Taking a couple breaths here. On your next exhale, bend your knee and bring it back to center. Extending your right leg up towards the sky, interlace your hands behind your right thigh. You can keep a gentle bend in your knee here if that feels a little bit more comfortable today. As you drive your right heel up towards the sky and flex your right foot towards your face. Feeling that stretch in your calf as well as your hamstring. You're welcome to stay here if this feels good or if you'd like to extend your left leg long against the mat to feel an additional hip stretch, then feel free. Take ankle circles one way and then the other. Lovely and release. Slowly lower your leg halfway and guide it over towards the left side. We've stretched the inner thigh. Now we're stretching the outer. Breathing here, wherever you are. Again, welcome to keep a bend in your knee if that feels better for you. Deep inhale and slow exhale. Gently making your way back to center, unravel, squeeze the knee in towards the chest and release. 
placing your right foot on the ground, knee is bent. This time, driving your left knee in towards your chest. And slowly guide it open towards the left side. Again, either with a bent or straight leg. Inhaling here. And exhale. A couple more just like that. On your next exhale, guide your leg back to center and extend your left leg up towards the sky. Driving your heel up and flexing your toes down towards the floor. If you'd like a deeper stretch, you can even move your hands up to your calf. Or stretch your leg closer towards the ground. But we're aiming for comfort here. Remember this is a lazy day stretch. Beautiful, begin to get your ankles and your feet involved, circling your ankle one way and then the other. Lovely. As you release your leg halfway, extend your right leg on the mat and gently guide your left leg over towards the right for that outer thigh stretch. Beautiful, gently guide it back through center. Drive your knee into your chest, one big squeeze. And then bring your right knee into your chest as well. And you're welcome to rock side to side as you massage your lower back. Place your hands at the back of your thighs as you rock and roll up and down your spine to come up to our frog pose. Or you can make your way there any other way. Making your way into our frog pose, knees are in line with our hips, ankles are in line with our knees, feet are flexed and active upper body is engaged making sure you don't have too much of a bend in your lower back keeping it neutral and you can stay on the hands or you can come down onto the forearms if this frog pose is feeling a little bit too intense you can place some blocks or pillows underneath your bum for some support or you can extend one of your legs long back behind you for a half frog pose. Letting your body guide you, letting you know what it needs today. 
we're going to spend about five breaths here noticing whether you're holding your breath at any point we tend to do this when things get a little bit difficult or challenging see if you can extend your breath slow it down Gently making your way onto your hands and slowly, slowly bringing your knees back together. Well done. We're going to find a toes pose here. Coming to kneel on your knees, tucking your toes under, making sure that each toe is nice and stretched out as you sit on your heels. Inhale as you interlace your hands, flip your palms, reach them up towards the sky. And as you exhale, bend over towards the left. Inhale back through center and exhale to the right. Two more times each side taking your time and matching it with your breath length. Beautiful and release. Tap out those toes, let the blood rush back and slowly come to sit on your bum, swing those legs out in front of you. Flexing your toes here, pressing the back of your legs down into the ground, finding a staff pose. Spine as long. As we walk our fingers forwards, hinging at our hips, keeping our spine as long as possible. Imagine here that you're reaching your belly down to the top of your thighs rather than your head down to your toes. and slowly release. Bringing the soles of your feet together, letting your knees fall out to the sides and bring your feet a little bit closer towards the top of your mat, so creating a big diamond. And gently fold over your legs. It's okay if you round your spine here. Let yourself relax. Inhaling deeply and exhaling slowly. Noticing where the sensations are coming up for you.
and on your next exhale slowly walk your hands up your legs to help you up this time bring the feet a little bit closer towards the body creating a smaller diamond with your legs interlacing your hands around your feet we're going to press the knees down towards the mat this is an active baddha konasana butterfly pose continue to press with all your strength press those knees down towards the ground building that strength and release slowly folding your upper body over your legs again allow your body to round that's okay once again noticing where in your body this stretch is coming up for you And very slowly beginning to make your way back up. Spine is long. Placing one hand on your heart and the other on your belly. Thinking about one thing that you are grateful for right here and right now. And remember to find some gratitude for yourself for making it onto the mat today, for taking this time for you. And as always, let's finish class with a big inhale, reaching your hands up and exhale, guiding your hands through heart center. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you've enjoyed this class. Feel free to like and subscribe for more classes and I will see you on the mat next time. Bye.